As schools around Colorado bounce between in-person and remote learning or a hybrid of both, at least one school is making sure kids get the same experience no matter what. And they're doing it with the help of Bob. Denver 7 education reporter Nicole Brady explains. <laughs> Like so many kids, Jayana Henderson is learning in her living room this year. Tell me about something that you want so badly. But she's seeing and hearing everything that happens in her classroom. Yeah, perfect. Thanks in part to Bob. So Bob, he is like a little robot. So he will follow the teacher wherever she goes. Bob is on all day long. Bob is what the third graders at Heritage Heights Academy named their swivel camera. And so you plug it into the fancy little holder here. Every classroom got a swivel this year. The cameras track teachers as they move around the room and they pick up the voices of other students in the class. All right, fifth graders at home, can you hear me okay? This fifth grade class has nine students in person and 10 learning remotely, but they do the same work at the same time. We're gonna pick up where we left off with our irregular verbs. Teachers say the biggest challenge is engaging both groups of kids simultaneously. The swivels help with that. It allows me to be free in the classroom, but also the kids at home don't feel so much like they're just talking to a screen. It feels more interactive. Miss Donnelly, Miss Donnelly. Back at home, Jayana doesn't have to feel like she's missing out. I feel like I'm part of the class, like every part of it. I'm still able to see my friends. I can still do my work better. It's really great that she has that independence with doing her work and that she's learning how to really build that relationship with her teacher. I'm so excited when I finally got this. That connection is so important this year, but I had to ask what will happen to Bob and his friends if things go back to normal? Heritage Heights bought the swivel cameras with future possibilities in mind. Snow day or sick day, if somebody was suspended, some of our families go to their native country. A constant connection between the classroom and the home, for better or worse. They're so dedicated that they're still zooming in even if they're sick. And some kids have tried doing that and they just look so groggy and it's like, it's okay, <laughs> rest. Yeah, Bob, give these kids a little break. It's been a tough year. Nicole Brady, Denver 7. Bob, keeping those kids on point there. Heritage Heights Academy isn't the only school with swivel cameras. The Aurora Public School District purchased 530 swivel devices for schools this year.